Okay, hello, I just want to talk about this interesting video tutorial about shell modifier. I was quite amazed how this feature works, not, not just shell, because when you add modifier shell, you can create volume of object. I found interesting copshell bevel edges, and I was really amazed what I did. I, I, I will grow flying again to show you Bezier Now after growing this When I pick Ah oh sorry I have to change the color Is almost invisible When you uh, bevel is flying When you pick this You can see Beautiful bevel edges, but I have to check if I can skill mo if I can skill modify this object. Oh, I can change position. Great, wonderful. This is what I wanted. Uh, not exactly. But as you can see, beautiful bevel object. The only issue is I don't know how to... I'm not sure if I can resize this whole object. Oh no. Because... I was able to bevel. But... 3ds Max doesn't allow me to... Resize is flying. There should be option like this. Oh yes, I found the out outer amount. And it's beautiful what this program can do. Now we have beveled part of our desk. I guess I was thinking if I will be able to create more complex shapes if I can create in the middle but I don't think so only when you create lost object but this is quite a nice feature my model of the desk later on I have to assign texture I hope you will like this video beautiful modifier shell but I never use this flying option as you see this is nice and cool feature.